Win. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Monday, August the 29th. This is the Tiger Financial News Network market update, 10 o'clock update. Basil Chapman here. Dow's down 214 at 32,061 after a thousand point drop on Friday. What we are looking at is support in the 32,000, I'd say 32,000 to 31,800 has to be. It's imperative that it holds over the next two, three days. <clears throat> and at least there's an attempt to get towards the 32,000. The high so far today is 32,188. Nice little rebound, but not good enough. <clears throat> You really want to see 32,350 sometime hit in the next uh, two days just to show that there is some support. You're looking at the uh, S&P. And the S&P also had a really sharp move down, 150 points or something on Friday, down another 23, uh, 4,034. Made a low today of 4,021. So it's come off that low a little bit. But most importantly, the uh, 3992, 3986 area is key support. Looking at the QQQ, the NDX 100 trading vehicle, down two at 305.35. Actually, it's down 0.72. The Dow's uh, percent, Dow's down 0.71 percent. S&P's down 61 percent. So they're all within the same range. So this is this is very important. The QQQ, I, I believe that most of the selling on Friday. Uh, after mid-session was more computer-related and the selling was just interminable. But there were a number of stocks that are really important stocks as far as I'm concerned that held very well. In fact, some of them made recovery highs on Friday before pulling back. So the uh, QQQ, uh, the IWM, I should put it in right now, the IWM is trading at, uh, let's see, it's down 1.34, also 0.71 percent, and 187.63, right on the 50-period moving average. Now this is going to be very interesting because gold had a sharp move down overnight into this morning. Now it's up for at 17.54, while the Dow, the dollar, went to a leg C, a new uh, multi-year high, to 109.48. It's pulled back sharply down. It's uh, it's 108.71. Actually, it's down 10 ticks. That's not such a big deal. But this internal strength a little bit left in the dollar. I'll be back in a moment. We'll look at crude oil. We'll look at bonds when I return for the Tiger Technicians Hour and check out my 